I'm sure a lot of the people that were at the Alder Grove Rock Festival back in 1968 would not be coming out to hear my shows. They did not enjoy what I did there. I was hired to, hired to go and play at a rock festival as a folk singer. <laughs> it was ridiculous. I didn't care. I was getting paid to play. I was, you know, when you're a young man, that's just, it strokes you and it makes you feel good to get up in front of 5,000 people. However, I started to play Suzanne Takes You Down to her place and the audience was yelling, Boogie! <laughs> there was definitely a mismatch going on. I played until someone clapped and I ran and went home. I wrote this song about it. And I have been sharing that rejection with audiences now for four decades. <laughs> Heartache experience here. Came into town as a man of renown. Director of songs and all the things. All had been written, and I was presented as the kind of singer most folks can enjoy. As a collapsed stinger to the stage, it was there. It was obvious something was missing. I could tell by the vibes they would Bright. They weren't in the mood to listen. They yelled out, play me a rock and roll song. Don't play songs about freedom and joy. Play me a rock and roll song. Don't play me no song at all. I got up and played some songs about peace and content, kindness. Things I've come to believe in When I was through To this chorus of boo Some track star yelled Thank God he's leaving Now someone play me A rock and roll song I've had to hear With their flower and beads Play me A rock and roll song I don't play me no song at all But if Where are they? They're down there, down there, yeah. That's all.